Yeah, more funding means new positions and four officers here at two schools in the district are making sure that money is being put to good work. Lots of students, almost 1700, so it constantly busy. A tax levy passed in March gave the Coeur d'Alene School District enough funding to increase some of its security. Two campus safety officers at Lake City High School and two at Coeur d'Alene High. They're different from school security officers, which are actual law enforcement there in the case of a crime. Campus safety officers are school employees working more directly with the students. Really just as a, a, a way to kind of help prevent problems from happening in the first place. It's Stacy Westberg and Connor Wilson's second week on the job. During class time, making sure students have their passes, you know, kind of keeping an eye out of what's going on around. Um, we just are there to help, you know, maintain the behavior and keep that rapport with them and stuff. They're also going to school related events and patrolling the hallways all day day. Record so far is 23,000 steps in nine miles. And checking the doors. To check, I'll go through and they're just push open doors and you just check and make sure that each one is locked. And monitoring outdoor areas. It's just one of our common hiding spots where students will ditch class and come outside and try and vape. The officers say safety is their main job, but they're also there to be a supporting resource for students. I think that's huge for them to know they have someone to go to. Something the crew says seems to already be working. Greeting them and they, oh, hey, Stacy, how's it going? And good morning. And, you know, ready to tell you about their weekend and stuff like that already, you know. The district is thinking about adding more of the officers, but that all just depends on funding. In Coeur d'Alene, Shana Waltower, Cram 2 News.